What's up guys? Welcome back to Thug Life Gaming. I'm your host Matt Rogers and today we're going to be talking about some Titanfall 2 quick tips. We're going to run through a few gameplay tactics that hopefully will help you guys out either while competing against friends or perhaps in online matchmaking. Feel free to leave a comment below and let me know what aspects of the game that you might want to learn more about here for the next episode. But with that being said, what do you say we get things started? Starting things off, tip number one is a strategy that I call wall watching. Now, of course, this is utilizing your AWOL tactical ability, and although it can be used within any game mode, it's probably most effective within objective game types like Capture the Flag. However, for video purposes, I'm going to be playing Amped Hardpoint. So all you have to do to pull this off is once you've made your way to an objective, go ahead and drop your AWOL just inside the perimeter. Once you've stepped in, your game HUD will actually alert you to whether or not it's being contested. If so, start wall watching. Remember, you're behind a protective barrier that opponents can't shoot through, so stay calm and collective and be patient. Eventually, most opponents reveal their positions, and once they have, you can safely take them out. After clearing the room, however, you can also perform this strategy in a defensive manner. Find a relatively safe area, and when you feel players are approaching, drop that tactical ability and begin to wall watch. Next up, tip number two is going to help you with pest control. Now, we've all been in the situation of being in a Titan when all of a sudden an enemy pilot decides to hop on board. Most of us will just wait for that player to jump off, try to locate them, and hopefully pick up a kill. This is basically a very efficient way of doing that. So, once you realize an enemy pilot has boarded, make sure that there's a clear amount of land behind your Titan. What you're taking into consideration is that the default rodeo animation of ripping a battery out of a titan does not give players the option to choose what direction they jump off. Every single time, it's going to be directly backwards. With that in mind, as soon as that pilot does jump off, all you have to do is dash or, if you're using the Ronin Titan, like myself, face shift directly backwards. Nine times out of ten, they're going to land right in your lap to pick up an easy melee kill or you're just simply going to squish them like the pesky bugs that they are. Now for our last tip, the phase attack will require that you equip the phase shift tactical ability, but also an arc grenade. I realize that this isn't necessarily the most popular form of equipment, but I can assure you that it has many benefits. 
ranging from reducing the movement speed of pilots to possibly disorienting enemy titans. For this tip specifically, it's going to come in handy when you find yourself in the vulnerable position of possibly being killed. So how do you do it? Well, if at any point during a match, you feel as if an opponent has the jump on you, go ahead and enter that phase shift. While you're in it, you can't actually damage opponents with bullets or equipment, but what you can do is pull the pin on your art grenade. This will allow you to throw it much quicker once you've exited out of that phase shift, and with the blast radius of it being relatively large, you're most likely going to hit the enemy. Once you have, it's just a matter of time before they fall victim to the phase attack. 